Now, a lot of good is coming from the All-Star Game. I think we've really seen that huh? all over the city, even beyond the city, we've seen a lot of this good. NBA Players Association actually donating $15,000 to a foundation focused on mental health. New special Zayana Lichen shares us uh, how they're going to use this money exactly. Yeah, that $15,000, sir, is going to make a big difference here in this community. I'm told that that money is going to be used to help fund some mental wellness resources for BIPOC families here in Summit County. The big game is drawing in people from across the nation. And while all eyes are on the game, they're also raising awareness for mental health. They're promoting mental health and how important mental wellness is and reducing that stigma along with giving us the funds to help people. That's, that's dual greatness. <laughs> the National Basketball Players Association Foundation donated $15,000 to Summit County Mental Wellness Alliance. 10000 of it is going to Jewish Family Services. Executive Director Ellen Silver says that they help people get mental health services that may not be able to afford it. 90% of our clients pay below $25 and about 70% around $5. Silver says they are able to offer services like this thanks to donations like the one from the NBPA Foundation. And this money will go far in allowing us to, to be able to offer that sliding fee scale to a lot of people. Joel Zaro is CEO and president of the Park City Community Foundation and says $5,000 was donated to the Solomon Fund which helps provide Latinx youth with outdoor recreation and sports opportunities. And when you think about the skiing, uh, after school sports, everything, uh, it, it takes money and it's a fantastic opportunity to engage people who wouldn't ordinarily get to have access. Zaro and Silver say they can't thank the NBPA Foundation enough for their donation because they say it will really make a difference. I really appreciate their leadership stepping up and destigmatizing such an important issue like mental wellness. And Jewish Family Services says they provide mental health resources to anyone who needs it. For more information on that, as well as the Solomon Fund, visit our website, ksltv.com. But for now, reporting in Summit County, Ayanna Likens, KSL 5 News.